my man. You are the most righteous. Yeah, right. Just get the fuck out, man. Let's go. Shit. Come on. Bobby Vasquez here, Capcom Bass Sports, collabing with Fight Hop, the one and only Gio. We're back. Back, man. We're back. A lot of people have been asking. And uh, what's up? Some people want want us to, well, actually, they've been asking to have, uh, you know, certain interviews. I've been contacted, and uh, it'd be good to do a collab with that. You guys are doing a great job over there. Um Fight Hop Podcast yeah. at gmail.com. Shout out to my yeah. boy Romeo Centeradze. You're doing pretty good. You're doing pretty good for yourself here, Bobby, man. Yeah, I yeah. I've just been uh, working on stuff because I want to let it all come out at the same time. Uh, I see you with the champs on every yeah. show. I see you with the champs, bare knuckle champs. Bare knuckle, got some UFC. I got a. Uh, Shout out, and, uh, CFFC I'm have, champion. Uh, Matt Favola's brother. On, I mean, uh, Matt Favola's uh, people on here. Uh, and a few other people. Some uh, boxing, MMA, and uh, BKFC. And a few you other got people Pumi there with a the belt. Pumi. Yeah, Pumi. He's doing good, man. Pumi, uh, yeah. man of his word. So he was coming on, came on. And uh, he did outstanding. He did outstanding job. In every way, I think he was uh, <clears throat> um, uh, just the job that he did was amazing. I think that uh, all around he did really well. Waiting nice for that call, UFC man. Call. Waiting for the call, yeah. You'll see, give him that call, you know. Speaking of what? which, speaking of which, it's kind of like the call for uh, junk food, right? Uh, what's up with junk yeah. food? You're talking about junk food before, right? Speaking of that, uh, what's up with that fight? Uh, yes, well, you know, with uh, Askren and uh, Paul, Jake, Jake Paul, it was like, you know, you had to stop watching UFC for a minute just so you could. You know what I mean, it's like junk food. You know, it's <laughs> you know, it's not good, <laughs> but you you have the craving. You want to see it. That's what he's right. so. But you know, it's it's you well, know, it's what it is, man. Uh. Um, for his Ben Askren to his credit, uh, his MMA resume, you know, is very, very good in spite of really good in spite of the fact that he had like the worst striking, but, but did do really well, but, uh, you know, I, I, I think that he was hurt anyway. I don't. I didn't see anything good coming out of. Had they had the ref allowed him to keep on. Round one. Round one. Not good, but you know. I think some people who are legitimate strikers, whether it's you could be an amateur, or whatever, legitimate strikers. Uh, I, you know, I don't see him like some of the bigger guys in the UFC that walk around his weight and whatnot, who are striking specialists or strikers first. We have really good striking. I, I I could see them beating him, beating that kid. Uh, but kudos to the kid; he did really well. You know, the lazy left went over with the right. You know what I mean, and, basic uh, stuff. You can, you can tell how much you meant to him, though. Though I don't know, like, you know, after he won, you could tell like it meant a lot. It meant to a him. lot but, to him, and and that's but, why I say know, kudos, man, because he went from being like, a, a YouTuber, man. Let me tell you, that takes a lot. Got to give him credit, man. Got to give him credit. Hey, man, his brother. Um, continue to make it happen. Having the eyes on him. <clears throat> having to getting the money up, man. Because uh, that was a hell of a payday. What he what what he made like three four hundred k. Well, uh, Askren made a what like five hundred k for like first round. <laughs> you know, and uh, you know it was it was it was uh it was different. The other. Match they had earlier, you know, I saw some some really good boxing there. Uh, skill, you know, because to his credit, yeah, he did great. But you always look at who's in front of the guy. You think Uncle Dana's gonna pay up? He, uh, <laughs> he put he if, if he put his money up. What Snoop Dogg said, get my money. No, you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh. Yeah, uh, Dana White. Oh yeah, 
Okay. Well, who did he make the bet with? He just said it. He said like, it. He, um, he said it, but he didn't say like. Did he say I'll give you know it wasn't you with or me. to who? Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, I know it wasn't with me. I know that much. Uh, but <laughs> but uh, nah, I, 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 Dana White's gambler. He does his thing, and yeah, it's like you know, it is what it is. And uh, you know, at least he backed this guy up. You know I mean, do I think it was uh? Did I see this guy winning? I did not. It's just he had nothing. Like, I, I I, didn't see anything that would, you know, I just saw the, it's just the easiest possible guy in MMA as far as striking, as far as boxing goes. Had it been an MMA fight, it would have been, Askren would have ragdolled him. And we know this. It wasn't. And he knew this too, that it wasn't. So, <laughs> So, you know, you signed up for it, buddy. What exactly. do you want me to do? You know what I mean? It is what it is, man. You know, it's like, uh, but it was okay. It was, it was pretty good. It was entertaining. And uh, he was gracious. And uh, I'd like to see, you know, somebody next who's uh, maybe could be a boxer. Doesn't have to be one of the highly ranked guys. Because, but someone who. Listen, or or not- striking specialist, someone in the M- in MMA or boxing, some besides someone like don't it get another basketball player name. or baseball player, but it has to be a name. It, it has, has to, to be, be a, name. a name. That's what. That's yeah, you what can't he's throw that. somebody Joe Blow up in there looking like you know, he just came. He just came from down the block with a you know with a bag of tootsie rolls. You know what I mean? Just going in there throwing lazy slow jabs like you're trying to grab him, bro. The simple, you know, they're trained. You know, you can hear the, the guy saying, "Oh, you don't load up." Of course, he could load up on a guy like that because he's sticking that, you know, slow left. You know what I mean? He just went over. He was loading line. up. No, no, he was, he was loading up. He was loading up, but I mean, yeah. I could see it. But he he could load up for a guy like uh, in all respect, all due respect, because his because his resume was great in MMA. But as far as striking, come on, man. Listen, uh, I'm not gonna sit here and tell you that I called it to a T, even though I just did. Mm-hmm. And I did call it to a T. Yeah. I said it wasn't going past two rounds. And when I was listening to all these pro fighters and they were, some of them were saying that Askren was going to win. I was just thinking there's no way if you've seen Askren standing in MMA, yeah. using a uh, striking stand in boxing yeah. and you compare it to, even though there's not a lot of footage on uh, Jake Paul and, uh, you can't really see a lot of stuff, but if you just see a couple of seconds, you can tell there's a difference between them. Oh, yeah. You know? So. Yeah. yeah. Look, man. Yeah. You could see. Sometimes you, the, the pads aren't always telltale, but because you see a guy, a person could look great in the pads. And, and there was no clinch but at all. That's what no Ben clinch. said he his, was going to work on. His best shot would have been the clinch. The guy tied, you know, use do what he does, no, and what he knows, but he didn't. He's on the outside, no head movement, easy to hit. He was getting hit to the body first, and then it was like, you know, easy pickings Say for hello the kid. To my little friend. Hey, what's what's up, man? How you doing, buddy? Hey, hello to your little friend. <laughs> but um, yeah, man. But, but like moving right along, man. Uh, the fights, the fights last night were. It was pretty good. Um, I'll tell you, man. Uh, yeah, what did you like? Well, I I liked the the, the Gastelum fight was was really nice. Yeah, man. The pace yeah. the pace and, was uh, unbelievable. And uh, Whitaker, man. the pace was amazing. Yeah, on both of the guys, on both of the guys, man. Both. The pace, yeah. Made for a great, entertaining fight. Absolutely, man. You know, I like the prelims, uh, the early prelims. You had some some uh, worthwhile, some really really good fights there. Uh. You know, but uh, moving along to uh, some upcoming fights, man. We got uh, Usman and Masvidal, Jorge Masvidal. You know, I like I like Masvidal. I said it. I like Masvidal. He's that's he's 